Hey guys, um, so today I am going to do a haul, um, just the few things I picked up in the last month or so, um, is a few makeup bits, I've, recently I've been wearing a lot more makeup, seeing as before I never used to wear makeup at all, my mum never used to let me wear makeup, like in school and stuff, so I never just, I just never wore it, I don't know why, um, you know, I, I didn't feel the need to wear it, but recently I have been wearing it, um, just like, not loads, just like mascara foundation and all that stuff. So I've been really looking for a foundation that, you know, is best for me and for my skin and whatever. Um, I did find one, but it's not really the, the right colour for me at all. Um, I'm very pale. Um, however, I did find one in the shop today that I'm going to go and buy tomorrow. Um, so yeah, which the one I'm buying tomorrow is by NYC and it's like the perfect colour for me. Um, but I did get this one. Which is Collection 2000 Natural Matte Foundation and Minerals. Um, it's a really good complexion and it just feels really nice on like skin. But it isn't. I can use it. I do use it, but it's in the shade Natural Beige. I don't even know what it says. Um, but yeah, so I I do use it, but it is a bit orange, so I just have to apply less. Next. We bought these, which are number seven flawless finish um, sponges. Um, I don't really use the sponges, but I wanted to try it with a sponge rather than a brush on my hand. So they're just the like, sorry, my window is like right there. So you get the general idea. I'm really sorry I'm getting Facebook messages. Um, should have turned that off. But yeah, just the number seven. These are about. You get these in boots for about. £3.50 or something like that, don't know. And um, so obviously because I'm trying new makeup, makes up, makeup and stuff, I am um, trying all different brands, so these are the ones that I just bought. So then I also bought this from number 7, which is a brow and lash brush, um, which you can see that, won't they? It's literally just like a mascara wand without the... Um, mascara on it so that you can really like even out your eyelashes and I really really like it I've used it a couple of times but really like that so next I bought MUA oh wait that was that was also from Boots and I think it was about four pounds so then next is MUA um lipstick I love their lipsticks I just love them um it looks like this you can see that um, it's in the shade 9, and um, yeah, it's like a really like dirty rose colour, um, I love it, it's pretty, next, I got these, um, so this, I'm oh, not sure where I got this from, my mum got this for me, um, it's the Moisture Renew, and I really like it because it's SPF, um, However, I do have a red uh, lipstick, lip gloss already, and it is a lot nicer than this one. The one I have is Barry M, and this one, it's good colour. The wand is way too soft, like, it just bends way too easily, so it's really hard to apply. And it doesn't really spread on your lips, you have to put it in place, so when you're at, it doesn't really spread. Which is really weird and really annoying. Um, and then I got this, which is a Benefit eyeshadow in the colour Honey Bunny. Um, it's a very, it's pretty much skin toned, with shimmer in it. Um, it's a creamy skin toned colour, and I just like it for when I don't really want to wear it, but I want to cover up a bit that even makes any sense at all. Um, next are the nail polishes. I bought four nail polishes this month. Um, two were from NYC and these were, I think they were two for three pounds. Two for three pound fifty. Two for something. Don't know whether they still are. I don't know. Maybe not. 
for you not know. Anyway, I got this mint colour, which is in mint macaroon. Um, I was going to buy the Barry M one, but they didn't have the Barry M mint in there, and I kind of needed it that day because the day after I was going to use it. So, but it's really nice. It's just, it's a bit off colour for rather than what I wanted, but it's fine. We can deal with that. So then the next one is in um, Lights Camera Glitter and it is, um, it's my phone, um, it's in like holographic and glitter and yeah, that's the, an overcoat. The next I did get a Barrett M, um, which is this colour and it's in the colour Berry 308 and it is just the pastel purple um the pastels are really popular this like i'd say spring but it is meant to be summer right now however outside it's raining that's a lie it's been raining all day but the sun has decided to come out at half seven at night which is bizarre anyway uh last nail polish this is from avon uh it's the pro wear so it looks like this and this color is so pretty um i wear this when i'm all girly and it's in the color rose gold you can't even see that brilliant but it is this pink rose color and so that when you look at it from one way it looks gold and then when you look at it straight on it looks pink um but I really really like it and really cheap as well, it was like two pounds I think or something there. So it's from Avon, if you're wondering. I bought a notebook. Now, this is a Jack Wills notebook. So I was in the outlet shop and normally in the outlet shops they don't have stuff like this on the sale, they just have them to the side anyway. Um, and I was just looking, you know, might have bought something and I picked this up. And so it's fourteen pound fifty originally. She was like, "I'm not buying it if it's fourteen pound fifty And I was like, "No, mum, I don't expect you to buy it if it's fourteen pound fifty. I don't want it if it's fourteen pound fifty." Um, so she went up and asked how much it was, and it was amazing. It was three pounds for this. That was only fourteen pound fifty. And then again, we looked and I found this. But this was it just is it's like engraved wheels. But it was three pounds, so it was cheaper again. I found these in the van shop. Ta -da -da! And these are £25 in sale. All we bought this in Jack Wills is a dress. Um I'm not sure how what how much it is, how much it was. I know it was cheap compared to what it was. Ah yes, it was £129, then down to 59 and then down to 44 You can't even see that, but it's true. Um, this one is my mum picked this out especially because she knows I'm obsessed with checkers. Um, so it's this checker dress. Um, these all stop above the knee. I hate anything that goes below the knee. A skirt. Oh my god, it's disgusting. Um, <laughs> and it has this like um bow thing to its back, and it just it's just the most perfect dress in the world. Perfect dress. And I love it. And I think it's really, really cute. And cutesy. And I'm going to look like Dorothy when I wear it. Yeah. And another one that is in the same style as that is this one. But it has lines. Um, I would have really loved it if this was a different colour because it just blends in and it's just wet. But I do like it, however. Um, how much were these? These are oh my god, that's so cheap. They were forty four pounds for Hollister. Wow. Not even in the sale. That's incredible. I'm I'm impressed, Hollister. You've impressed me to the max. I love you. And the last dress that I have it's once again from Hollister. This, again, this is a different style, so it might be made. It may be more. Oh, yes. This one is £50. 
pounds over them. But I prefer this style, so thank you. We'll let you off this one time. This is this pink, pink, it's not even pink, it's red. This red dress, which has, it doesn't have tears like the other one. It's just a single long dress. Um, it is stretched at the back though. Good to get around the old boobage area. Um, they have, what are they called? I don't know, but they're on, on Alice in Wonderland. Maybe not. I don't know these things. Birds, we'll call them. And I love it. It's so pretty. I would have preferred it in different colour. However, I wasn't with my mum when she bought them. So I had to, I had to trust her on the colourage and the size. Luckily, she did get the right size. I'm not sure what size they are. I think they're medium. The medium, eh? I'm medium everything in Hollister. Got. This is from Primark, £10, um, because of the whole craze of onesies at the moment. My mum bought me one, even though I already have one. She bought me another one, because she loves me very much, and I'm a very spoilt child that is very grateful for everything my mother has ever bought me in the world. <laughs> it is this onesie, which is blue, with stars on. Um, it's only ten pounds, so it's quite cheap for one thing. And yes, good talking to you. Um, if I missed anything out, comment down below. Oh, comment down below. Um, on any questions you have, anything. If you want to hate on me, hate all you like because I love you, the haters. My hands are pink, by the way. If you haven't already noticed, because I dip dyed my hair pink. God, it didn't really work but I like it that's the main thing thanks for watching um again if you have any questions or anything comment down below thumbs up or dislike whichever you fancy and yeah comment rate subscribe and I will see you next time bye Ow. This guy is Shane Ritchie's son, and I met him at the weekend. Um, and I also went to Shiko when I say Shiko, no big deal. Bits and bobs I picked up in about the last 